and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Pula at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Pula back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today I'm gonna be going over how to prepare, or should I say, what to expect. I won't go too in depth on how to prepare just yet. Probably be a separate video once I got all that, you know, ready, set, written down to go. For the time being, I'm gonna be going over what to expect during the playoffs promo. Now, if you guys know what the playoffs promo is, it's pretty self-explanatory. When the NFL playoffs is upon us in real life, it will be upon us in Ultimate Team. So, playoff promo brings about pretty much all the teams currently, or we don't know yet. As of tonight at midnight, when all the playoff brackets are out and the, the NFL regular season is officially over, we will know the playoff bracket. So, all the teams that are actually participating in playoffs will all get cards. So, typically the way they do it, and by the way, I will go back actually to Madden 19 to show you all the playoff sets, you guys, all you guys who haven't played last year or didn't know. Or trying to be up to date, we'll know all the things that include with the playoffs. But typically, the playoffs includes all the teams involved. You're going to get like low overall players from the teams, medium players from the teams. You'll get the MVPs of the team. So, let's say the Falcons. Let's say if the Falcons are that, let's actually be a real playoff team. Let's say the Patriots, right? Tom Brady got a card. So maybe for the Patriots, they'll give us a Sony Michelle playoff master who'll be like a 95 overall player. Now, has Michelle been amazing this year? No, but at the moment, they don't have too many offensive weapons. Maybe they'll give us an Edelman 95 or maybe Stephon Gilmore 95. Stephon Gilmore 95 actually sounds very, very likely. Keep that in mind. But for the most part, that's pretty much how it works. We'll get some of the decent players, some of the best players, some of the actual the best player that they think will be their best playoff player. And then they'll also be like the playoff performers. Like they've done that in the past, like LTDs for players who are doing good in the playoffs. So let's say in the first Patriot game, Stephon Gilmore gets two picks and he saved the he saved the, the first round for them he might get a ltd playoff performer and you guys get the point but we're gonna go back we're gonna go check out everything but before we get into the video remember to see 25 days of food miss that's still going strong all you guys did to enter as per usual is comment down below the secret word comment down below your console like the video and subscribe to the channel once you do all this you're entered to win and by the way guys don't forget i did announce today's winner on today's 10 30 video going over the ltd clomax so let's go check that out see if you had a chance maybe you won go back to that video go check it out real quick see if you won and then make sure to do that after this video of course now, guys, we're going to go over to Madden 19, which is really cool, actually. We're going back to the old Madden real quick to show you guys the playoff promo, all the sets, and kind of what came along with it, so I can give you guys my most in-depth analysis of it. So let's go on and head on over. Guys, okay, so we're back on Madden 19, as you guys can see. What am I about to be given? Okay, I'm not even going to open the access reward pack. Actually, I will at the end for some fun, but guys, real quick, let's pay some tribute to the team real quick before we head on out and go check out the playoff. Let's see what we had. I just want to see what we had. Yeah, the team was pretty solid. I do remember this team all right. I definitely, I stopped playing towards the end, so I never really got all the newer upgrade stuff that you would come along with it, but this team was definitely overpowered as hell. I was definitely a little bit behind on terms of everything, but let's go. Not the point, why do I have 4,000 coins? That must have been the Rick Premiers. So let's go over to sets. This game is really different, actually, throwing me off. And let's go over to the playoff set so we can have an idea for what we're looking at. Let's see, it should be right around the playoffs. So, right after Zero Chill is the NFL playoffs. Now, if you guys didn't know, the NFL playoffs, the, this promo typically starts very quickly after Zero Chill. So, Zero Chill should be ending around the 31st total. Probably, like, you know, the official last day, going to New Year's. And last year, the playoff promo would have been this Saturday. So, not the one that just passed yesterday, this following Saturday. So, somewhere around, like, the 5th or 6th is when it did drop. And the playoffs comes very quick, and then the Team of the Year promo starts. So, for now, we're going to worry about the playoffs. So, the NFL playoffs, as you guys can see, is to the AFC, the NFC, and the Exchange. So start with the exchange sets real quick. So exchange playoff, playoff wildcard players. These are like the, just the regular standard players, like the zero chill cards. There was the gold exchanges, the player exchanges. There's the tokens, which we had gold and silver, which we don't have this year. So that's going to be a different dynamic in terms of that. As well as the playoff trophy exchange, which was just exchange of trophies for random elite NFL players. But this year, they haven't really used trophies as a means of exchange sets this year, which is very different. So start with the AFC now. So the AFC, they had an AFC master and then all the teams. So there's a total of, I believe, what is it, 18? There's six teams. So there's six teams per. So there's six teams here. So there's the Colts, Chargers, Ravens, Texans, Patriots, Chiefs. Those are those three. And then the master. So the master, I guess, would be a player from any of those teams. But this one, they did it with legends this time around. So there was a legend for both. Actually, I'm not going to do the NFC yet. So back to what I was saying. So the Chiefs, they use Mitchell Schwartz. Now, typically, guys, it's not going to be a player, the most popular player on the team. It's going to be a player on the team that hasn't gotten an upgrade yet and kind of lines up. So let's say for the Chiefs making it this year, could it be Tyreek Hill? It's possible, although he does have a pretty recent card. But don't get me wrong. It is possible they could use Tyreek Hill again. Now, Tom Brady, don't think we'll have him. And the, these are kind of similar teams that we'll be making it this year again, too, besides the Chargers. And I'm not sure about the Colts just yet. 
But for the most part, you guys get the idea. So let's go to the Patriots. So the Patriots will be making it. I don't think it would be Brady, probably Gilmore. Now the remaining players, the Lawrence guy was one of them, Sonny Michelle, Patrick Chung, Chris Hogan, John Simon, and Trent Brown. So these go down from like 91s all the way down to like somewhere in the 80s. So you have to imagine at the top, they're going to be some of their better players. I think Gilmore could be a master. I think Sonny Michelle could get one of the lower cards again. Similar players will probably get the cards from the Patriots. They typically have similar team. And like I said, it's going to be for every team. So just you guys know the format. Every team that makes it from each uh, AFC and NFC will get it'll be probably six again. They will, well, not in the real life. That's not what I'm saying. This, I'm just giving you guys the, the thing for this set specifically. There will be six. There will be a certain amount of players in the set with probably a master. They'll probably follow the same format. Now, as far as the AFC master goes, the AFC, oh, by the way, these are collectible just like they were last year. You put all the players in and you get the top player. Now, I don't remember if you got them back in that. I believe for the AFC master was when we get them that. So here, the AFC master goes like this. It's going to be one player that played in the AFC that's probably from one of the playoff teams. They used William McGinnis last year. Who could they use this year? I would. I couldn't tell you what legend they'd probably end up using. But you could take all of them, put them into the set, and get back 97 William McGinnis. And you have to choose four of the six items to be Nat. So this is like those sets that I always love. Except this one didn't give you all six, which kind of sucked. But it was definitely a worthwhile value. Let's see. I mean, I doubt. I don't know what they're going for now. Probably, yeah. I don't think anyone's even playing this game now. But pretty much, they went for about like three to 400k each. So 400 times six. It was like 2.4 million. The word is Grinch. Comment down below the word Grinch. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. And comment your console. Once you do all this, then you to win. Good luck. And then this one went for like one. And William McGinnis went for like 1.6 million at the time. So you'd, you'd, you'd essentially spend, if you sell back William McGinnis, like 800k and you get 495 overalls back which was a great value at the time except i didn't have the coins at the time and i really didn't like a lot of these players i couldn't use most of these players hopefully they make them a little bit more usable this time around now let's go over to the nfc to show you guys what we're rocking with here this one was steve smith now steve smith was a pretty cool one but no one really cared for the steve smith and mcginnis most people cared about doing the set and selling them off and these weren't the biggest players i hope they do prove that this year they give us better legend like maybe like um couldn't get I, I don't have any on the top of my head right now and give us some legends that we really want to see in the game worth using or maybe even legends that we could put into an upgrade set because i believe steve smith was the first no no i think he had a legend before in this one i don't know hopefully they give us some guys that we could use or at least upgrade and that'd be really cool so for the this one we had brandon cooks Lattimore, eddie jackson zach martin and dwayne brown once again not a popularity contest dwayne brown got it for the seahawks when you could easily have put wilson there or someone else along those lines zach martin the lineman for the cowboys so that's actually pretty important for them eddie jackson was great Lattimore and cooks so Again, this year, because really the dynamic could change greatly. The Ravens, I don't think it'll be Lamar Jackson, because I think they're saving him for an MVP card. So remember that also, if guys are in line to get other cards, they probably won't get it. So that's it for the Ravens, probably won't be Lamar. It could very well be Mark Ingram. It could be Mark Ingram. It could be Hollywood Browns, one of the high set pieces. And one other guy, maybe defensively. Now, Marcus Peters might be another set piece. I don't think there'll be too much too much um uh, I don't there's no, I think it'll probably be Mark Ingram. That'll be the best bet. And then again for the master set, same format. You put them all in. And you get four back out of the six. Now, I don't know if they'll do four out of the six this year. They really haven't made it this year to where you have to pick a certain number out of that. They've done pick one. They've done pick two. But they've never done, like, there's six of them. You can only pick four. It's other than you only get some or you get the whole thing. I don't know. They could change it. And as far as playoff packs go, guys, playoff packs in the years past have always been really fun. I don't know. They've always been kind of like a fun pack for me to open. Do I recommend opening the bundle? I don't know. Last year, they did give us a option for like a bundle that gave us one free 99 overall player, which would be the first 99 overall player of the game, which would be the Super Bowl MVP. I hope they give us another bundle like that during the playoff promo. Last year, it was during the Blitz though, so don't, don't correct me. I know it was during the Blitz, but there was no Christmas Blitz this year, so I'm going to go with maybe they'll throw it into the playoff thing, or maybe they just won't do it again at all. But if they do do that, remember that is a pretty cool bundle because you will get the Super Bowl MVP. Hopefully, it's not Julian Edelman again because that was definitely a bust. Now, the sets and everything, this was kind of covering the sets. Now, the solos, we can go check out Solo Challenge, but solo for the playoffs, just like any other solo, they'll probably give you enough pieces to almost get one of the Masters for free, or they'll give you one Master Nat. We can kind of assume every year it's going to be similar, similar formats. So, let's go find the playoffs. They're probably in archivists. No, they're right here. So, the playoff solo challenge is playoff Chiefs, playoff Patriots. So, if you do all, okay, this is how it worked last year. So, pretty much, you played a whole, you played their whole five game series or see a uh, series that they had that was quick, and you get one of their players from their sets. That was 84 to 93. So if you played all of them, you might hit big, you might get a 93, you might get a 92, you might get one of the 84s. So pretty much if you got any of the big ones from any of them, you'd probably want to go do their set. It would be worthwhile. So essentially you'd probably end up getting one for free when all is said and done. And they were nats. So if you had them, you were kind of stuck with them. So you probably might as well just finish their set. Now maybe this year they'll probably do it different. They'll probably give us a house rules where we can maybe get one of them for free. Or maybe one of the top ones for free, which would be very, very cool. And definitely help us in our goal of trying to get one of them for free that would be really cool i imagine the playoffs would be similar because guys they have followed a very very similar format every year and these two this year to last year we've been able to predict 
very much what was going to come out. We got the go like the zero chill was almost identical. They changed they changed the players. They changed when they drop them. They changed the format by which they drop them. But they always have a similar formula, especially with things that are popular. So I imagine this will stay very very similar. So definitely stay on the same lookout for all that. And hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. You guys are prepared now i will make a video going over how to prep coin wise and card wise and binder wise but for the time being i'm giving you guys what to expect so you guys can have an idea of what you're, what you're coming into because this is going to probably be from a week from now the playoff promo might be in the game ready zero chill did come out a little bit later but it's going to end around the same time so we still should be on track and the team of the year probably sometime around the somewhere between january 14th and january 26th i imagine it'll be sometime between there so stay tuned for that it's typically after the regular season which is right in line with playoffs but guys that's about it for the video hope you guys did enjoy hope it was kind of cool coming back on the madden 19 to show you guys a little bit of what we could be expecting but that's it for the video guys remember to enter the 25 days of food miss all you gotta do is enter is subscribe to the channel like the video comment down below the secret word and your console once you do this thing you're to win good luck thank you for watching this video see you guys in the next few videos today i have a special one later tonight so stay tuned for that that's about it i'm out see you in the next video peace